Good morning. We're so happy you're here. That's my style. <laughs> we daily vlog, so if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you come back every day. Yes. I took a lesson from yesterday's vlog and will not selfie <laughs> in the car on I-4. It's just <laughs> too crazy. So today is a really big day. Yes. And then there's minor reasons why today's a big day too. The biggest reason is today is Sarah's dad's birthday. Yes. Um, that's why I'm wearing this this awesome red shirt with Main Street, Marceline, and everything yeah. on there that Earhart's got me um, for his birthday. Yes. What, are, what else are we celebrating? Oh, <laughs> like can, can you tell that we stayed up late? Sarah edited the vlog last night, and then we got up early so I could start working, so I could we could leave to get to the Airbnb before I had to actually start working. Yeah, um, I was like, what? What else is going on today besides pool? Yeah, but we're going to the Airbnb now. You can tell that I've been getting a lot of sleep lately because look at my eyes from only sleeping like five hours. First stop of the day is Dunkin' Donuts and who would go to Dunkin' Donuts every day? Your dad. My dad. My dad would go. We had a coffee pot, but like he'd always go It was the social get, aspect, I think. I think it was the social aspect. Um, yeah, so we're going to pick up Dunkin' Donuts for everybody and us too. I'm excited. I haven't, we haven't had Dunkin' Donuts in a really long time. Probably since Christmas tree chopping down last year because we always stopped there on the way. Unless, no, I don't think we got it while we were there for Christmas. But we really don't. We did, like, not for Christmas. Not for Christmas, but for. Christmas tree. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we really don't get it here. So it'll be a nice little treat. Check this awesome setup out. Frozen 2, work laptop. Recliner. This is a good way to work if I do say so myself. So now that it's daytime, I wanted to show you the garage cool area. But this this pool table, I got some rounds in last night. It brought me back. I grew up with a really nice pool table in my basement. And it was probably the closest thing to like consistently something I did as a child or a teenager, like playing silly games, but then taking serious games when I was later, like when I was older in life. So it was really fun when I got to be like a teenager, me and my friends actually like played with intention on there. But I'm still working. Um, Sarah doesn't know it yet, but I am, I got approved to take the next three days off work. I have to do things in the morning still, and I have to, do, I have to attend one meeting tomorrow afternoon, but I don't have to be concerned about constantly being on and getting work done and being accessible to emails because I'm using, Gonna use vacation time, I think, for the next three days um, to really soak up the time we have with who is here. But so that's good news. But I do have a bit because of that, I'm kind of like scrambling. I was, you know, the office like work was closed yesterday for the holidays, so it's not it's not only like a case of the Mondays with catching up from week and stuff. But now I'm also like trying to get ahead and get everything settled for the rest of the week, knowing that I'm not going to be fully accessible to my team and everything. But they're all super supportive, so that's great. Um, but I'm wondering, I'm guessing about five hours, in, if not way more, maybe 10 hours of pool table time over this next week. So we have been having such a good Afternoon. Peter has still been working, um, but it's the start of what will be more of a relaxing week overall. And I mean, we talked about this when we were like planning our cruise. Like, we don't vacation where we just sit and relax and just do nothing. Like, typically, we go to Disney or we've gone on road trips and stuff. And so, it's been really weird to just like not doing anything. Um, obviously I edited the vlog last night and I'll edit again tonight so it's not like there will have to be you know work to be done um, but it just feels really good and like we needed it and I think that the water has been perfect um, for my body and I'm excited for Peter to be able to be done with work. I just made some buffalo cauliflower just simple um, salt pepper and buffalo sauce and we are going to get some pub subs for a later lunch and then maybe even market on south for dinner tonight because 
we rant and rave about it all the time and we want to share it. I don't see the gator now, but earlier today it was just like on the shore, like laying here. So I wonder if this is just his home and we'll be seeing, well, I guess him or her a lot this week. 526 and I'm done officially working for the weekend. Doing a little bit of work, but not too much. And we got Poco on. More importantly, I wanted to show you before I go on to go swim with everybody. Look at this red jumpsuit. Red shirt, red swimming trunks, red jumpsuit. It feels so good to be, I have my out of office on. I haven't had an out of office on in over six months. So I'm technically out of office until Monday, but I, like, I have one meeting to go to tomorrow, a couple reports to run here and there in between, but that's the name of the business. My boss was super accommodating. was like, hey, yeah, go ahead and take the PTO. Enjoy the time that you can um, now during the long weekend. So that's awesome. And we just heard from Katie. She's, she's still on board to take Eve tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. Um, so you'll get to see Katie tomorrow and see some of her pups, I believe. I think she, she'll have them tomorrow. Uh, but time to go in the pool because the family has been in and out of the pool all day and I have not been able to join them once. So I am ready. My jam-packed day. I got the things I needed to get done, done all in the last like 20, 30 minutes. I was nervous I'd have to work late, but it all came together last minute and I'm ready to go now. Check it out. Since we have visitors in our neck of the woods, we'll check in our apartment for the first time. We had to pick up Market on South. Looking extra beautiful at nighttime. Oh yeah. Okay, as our night comes to an end. We're taking a longer route home. We're taking a longer route home, but we're doing so to just give a little extra happy birthday magic to my daddy-o. To Papa. His favorite place on earth. It's good to be home. Yay! So we noticed California Grill is on. I feel like I haven't gotten a good look at the castle the last few times driving through because I'm driving. driving. <laughs> Um, that was I a just, good view. I just got a good long like three four second glance at the castle. <laughs> Purple lights on, windows lit. Yeah. Um, on the college program, like on my way to work, I used to like pray to the castle. Ooh. Like I used to like have moments like that and like you saying like you had like a moment like that reminded me of that. Watch you back. Shortly after this vlog goes live, Orange Disney's gonna do the presentation to the Orange County Task Force and propose of when they should open back up so the day that this vlog goes back up we will know a potential reopening of Walt Disney World Day. That's crazy and I'm sorry for all the times that clip went blurry. Wow we saw three different gates tonight because we also um, had gone back to our apartment earlier in the day and that is pretty cool. This girl right here She's exhausted. I am. I forget how much swimming really takes a toll on you, but it's good. It's a good thing. Yeah. But I'm really tired and I gotta edit. Someone had a very rambunctious day with the visitors earlier. Yeah. You happy? <laughs> I think you're happy. Look at your fangs, Evie. Here's the real joy. It's midnight. Sarah's about to start editing the vlog. We have an entire microwave full of the desserts that weren't finished yet. But per this week's agenda, I'm going to finish out the vlog so Sarah can take the memory card. We had a bunch of birthdays today. May 26th, Ray Bradbury. Stuff your eyes with wonder. Live as if you drop dead in 10 seconds. See the world. It's more fantastic than any dream made or paid for in factories. Hey, what's up? My name is Hey Arnold Peter. <laughs> That's what my name is. No, I, I feel like prison, prison guard, prison. Prison Mike? Prison Mike. Um, no, there's one kid with the backwards hat. I feel like his name is Sid. From here, no. Sid? I, whenever I think of Sid, I think of destructive little children. Oh, because of Toy Story. You want to see a destructive little child? Eve. That is a Ew. destructive little child. She's also very explorative right now. Yeah. I am in disbelief that Peter is taking off the rest of the week of work. I mean, like, I. I know you have doing to do work, work each day, stuff. but but that is just making me so happy 
and I don't know I feel like it'll feel real once we're there and we stay there we are dropping off Evie tomorrow morning at Katie's um, she's gonna watch her for us and then we're gonna spend the rest of the time like actually spending the night some people had asked some questions about like oh you're just like waiting until waiting until Peter's done with work but Peter's actually been working like you saw today at um, at the Airbnb so it's nice that it only ended up being one day it's good to be home good to be home Sarah say it she's not gonna say it she's a dog Sarah <laughs> We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.